She would have heard him. Yes, she would have heard him. But if Raymond was the killer, very easy to push that screen out from the inside. Yeah, but at the time of death, he couldn't have done it. Sure. Now, that, that's calculated from body temperature, right? A liver temperature, yes. Yeah. She had a fan pointed right at her, like it was really hot. But it was mid-70s. Perfect day, fan. Did you ever cook a roast? Of course. Yeah, sorry. My aunt used to do it this way. She turned the oven way up high. You heat it. You put the roast in, and then you turn it off. So maybe he turns the thermostat all the way up, tells her it's broken. And then he turns the thermostat off after he kills her. The room and Nicole cool off slower, making it seem like she died later than she actually did. Exactly. What about the fan? He turned off both the fan and the thermostat. And then he leaves. Then he leaves. Ah. Front door. Looks like it was wiped down. For Prince. Raymond doesn't have to worry about Prince. It's his house. Well, maybe he got blood on it. No, he's too meticulous. You're right. He wouldn't have made that mistake in the first place. Maybe he was wiping off somebody else's Prince. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh. A woman. It had to have been a woman. There was a woman with him in the car for the red light photograph. After Nicole was already dead? Yes. We need to find out who that woman was in the car. It gives him motive. How do we find her? Well, I think it's time I paid out Colonel Raymond a visit. Have a little talk about tactical solutions to urban terrorism. You could just I told you. Tell me one. You can't quit. You're having too much fun. Judy. Oh. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I think we're going to have to pass... Not on. enough closet space. You heard the woman. 